and uh, we are already converted. So even without his preaching, President Buhari belonged to this altar. But our problem is we have never been supported by Mr. President. Anytime he, is pro he has a problem, this ministry carries him to the uppermost part of the sky, spiritually. But zero benefit. Even in Islamic culture, ingratitude can pull somebody down. We are here. Here was a big forest when we came in. Because of Buhari, because we supported him, we are chased out. These things you are seeing, we are building this by ourselves. No one person has been employed by Buhari after Fadambaka almost died and rose for his sake. Madam. The issue of supporting Buhari. Um, oh, if you were here when we are speaking to P2B, representing Atiku. How I wish you were here. I know that Obi went out here almost disgraced. So, supporting Buhari is almost becoming a curse. It's no longer a blessing. We won't tell you that we will not support him. Even if not for his sake, for the sake of his good wife. She has been sending some little uh, charity articles, food items we give to the poor. But this ministry must be built. For his sake, I was almost being assassinated because we stood for him. APC was down till the prophecy came up here that Buhari is going to be the president. And after that, we were forgotten and abandoned. We are delaying that Atiku will come and see me because I want to know what we can do that will not be put to shame by supporting somebody that God has not approved. I will give you the microphone. Listen, Governor. You know, you, when you were speaking about evil people in Canada, this, this is all we know. We have been supporting you people. If you know what this ministry is passing through, because we are supporting Buhari. And the, the attackers are waiting to hear me say that I'm supporting him again. And the attack will start. And the Buhari will remain in his asshole rock, being somebody who cannot give money. What does that mean? All the people they are given a location, what qualification do they have that we don't have? Who among them have done for him what we are doing for him? Not what we have done, what we are doing for him. It's because of this Buhari that we have told Peter to be all this rubbish he had today. And I want to tell you, if Buhari will remain ungrateful to this ministry, he is going nowhere. The one who has supported him, what is holding him is spiritual. How many times had he died almost? And he should not take it for granted that he's now healthy. Anything can happen and his head will collapse. Atiku is waiting for him somewhere. And the only thing that can stop Atiku is spiritual. So, you people should go and come back. You should not take us for granted. I am speaking with spiritual mandates. Even if people don't want to do something for us, look at the pharmacy that almost died for you people. Not even a broom job is given to anybody. How can I speak to them again to support? All of them love Buhari, but they have been abandoned by the same Buhari. So, I am asking you, if you can save, even the image of this, yeah, our brother who wants to be the governor. If you listen, the moment he said he wants to be the governor, people started shouting, no.
Can you sense it? Because they felt hot. This is the you have not seen the adoration people. These are people who came for the bazaar. If you come in any of our crusades, or come here, send somebody to the first night, December. You will know the capacity of the people grieved. Our loyalty, our support for Buhari is not debatable. But the way that he has paid back to us is dangerous and cancerous and destructive and can pull any leader down. That is why if we now stop supporting Uruguay and start supporting this man, he doesn't need to spend one kubo to win. But as of now, the holy Nugu, forget about those who are deceiving him. So, I want you to help and clean the image. It's a culture of ingratitude. And I don't want that to continue. Like now you have come, when you go, tell him, say, so they will invite me in Abuja, I will come and stay for one week and come back. Nobody will see me. I will call and call and call. And even when we see him, listen, if I tell you the level of fasting and prayers that are generated from this ministry, for Buhari's health, for his continuity, if there is time, I will take you to where I was living. Because of this Buhari, I am in this bush. Can the federal government take this ministry as a project? What will it lose from their pocket? A ministry that will back them spiritually and they will go forward. So when you go, you organize your people. Tell them that the man called Mother Kai has not been rewarded. Therefore, the king will never have rest. You know, Jonathan thought with all the things he had as a president that he will win. Jonathan is on this side. He's my brother, my friend. But he was alive and I told him he will not win. He should resign honorably or he will be disgraced publicly. That Buhari is taking the chair. If it is a place where things work well, the moment Buhari climbs to that chair, he will come here. What does it take him? One morning flight, he comes here and thank the minister that made him who he is. Then he can fly back. So it's not a matter of breaking cola with anything and which announce uh, silently. They will still know because it will be in the record. Please, um, what I will try to tell my people here, when you go to an imam, and the, an imam hides his feeling and tells you the lies you want to hear, he should be cursed by Allah. What I'm telling you is not even up to the level we are feeling. All those who supported Buhari are living in hunger. All who supported him are abandoned. All are unrewarded. I don't say we will not support him, but hear this message and tell him. If he will not change, he will be changed. You have to tell him the truth and God will save him. Allah will save him. The people around him are not helping matters. Buhari is a good man. So when you go, you see the young man that is being held there. He wanted to come and take the microphone away that people are not happy matters. People are holding him. But people are not, they're not happy. Hunger brings anger. So if you can arrange for a time, he can come here. He may not know what this minister stands for. This is the... This is the gum that can unite many things for you people. And God will bless you. So thank you for coming. And as you go, may the Lord protect you. Save Johnny and come back again. If you come meaningfully, we welcome you joyfully. God bless you. See now, bye-bye. And inshallah, it shall be well.